Ant and December's £30 million golden handcuff site TV deal thrown into jeopardy. The boys signed a three-year deal with the broadcaster in 2017 worth £30 million. The golden handcuff deal means that they can only present on ITV. Now with Ant checking into rehab at a reported expense of £300,000, the deal could be off. Speaking to Daily Star Online, media lawyer Mark Stevens, CBE of Howard Kennedy Solicitors, has admitted it would be possible for ITV to call time on their arrangement with Ant and December, despite the contract. When someone is ill, whether that's because of drink or not, and they need to go to rehab, or indeed any other reason, then there are provisions. The show will go on as long as it is contracted. But the real question is when commissioning editors make the decision for the future, they want to be sure that the talent is fit to deliver a performance. That is the question that is now hanging over as a consequence of Ant's actions. It is likely to have an impact on December. If you suddenly get caught in a scandal for example, then the broadcaster has the right to cancel the contact Mark Stevens speaking generally about large-scale contracts like Ant and Ike's golden handcuff steel, Mark continued, one of the selling points of them is that they are a pair of cheeky chappies and you now have to find an alternative pair, or you have to have a double header like with Claudia Winkleman and Tess Daly on Strictly Come Dancing. It depends on whether ITV want to stick with it, this is very much in the hands of the broadcaster. The contracts have behavior clauses and so they make sure you to behave professionally and also not to alter the public persona you have. Revealing how these are kept as ambiguous as possible, the legal ace added, that would be fairly loosely and broadly worded and interpretable, so if you cease to be a homely household figure or your reputation changes for whatever reason. Effectively not a presenter suitable and appropriate for light entertainment during peak viewing hours. Then in those circumstances they usually have the right to terminate the agreement. However, December could be able to cling on to his part of the deal. They could terminate one and not both, but it is likely to be more complex situation as effectively they were buying a duo and what you can use a duo on compared to a solo artist is very different. He went on. You could pair December up with another piece of talent, but then you would be into the Claudia and Tess scenario as opposed to a duo.